Hey guys, happy Monday. Um, Coach Becky here. I um, wanted to make you guys a video about something that we have coming up that's really fun and exciting. And um, we're really hoping that everybody will participate. Um, this year, starting on February 22nd, we have something coming up called the CrossFit Open. And some of you guys being new to CrossFit may not know exactly um, what that is or what it does. And so I'm gonna explain a little bit about what it is. Um, the CrossFit Open is the first series of events basically that leads to the CrossFit Games, which you may have heard of that will come out this summer. Um, basically, any athlete um, that has been doing CrossFit at an affiliate uh, gym can compete in some workouts that are going to be released starting in March. And um, basically, once a week, a new workout will be released um, publicly by the CrossFit company. Dave Castro is one of the um, head guys that will come on TV or on the internet and he'll announce what the workout is. And then we'll have um, about a week to complete the workout. And as individuals, you'll register and you'll get your um, chance to come in and do the workout. And, um, and then you can put your scores into the computer and they end up ranking you among all over the world for people at your age group and your level. I um, mean, you kind of get to see where you have fallen. Um, um, in those rankings. So, um, and then from there, um, these top level CrossFit athletes around the world, um, get pulled out of the top, the ones who come out on top of these, uh, five weekly workouts and go to regionals. And then from regionals, they go different places and, um, different competitions that eventually lead to the official CrossFit games, um, which is kind of a cool thing that CrossFit does because, um, anybody in the world has a shot. Um, which is pretty neat. But on our level at CrossFit Roadhouse, um, we want to do it just as part of our community. We want to do it just to test ourselves um, and really just have fun and to be together um, and see how we do. Um, so I'm going to talk to you a little bit about how to register and what that looks like and what you would do if you decide that this is something you want to participate in. And then I want to tell you about my experience last year um, in the Open. So first, if you decide that this is something that you want to do, which... Um, from personal experience, it's a blast. So I would say that if there's any part of you at all that thinks you could do it in your schedule, um, I would say go for it. Um, so what you're going to do is you're going to go to games.crossfit.com. And I have it pulled up, so I'm going to show you what that looks like. So you get on the website here, and um, you just click the sign up button. And from there, it will show you... Um, how to fill out your profile um, and register you for the game, the open. Um, so the open costs $22. So when you register, it'll ask you for your information. It'll create an account for you. And then it does cost $22 to participate in. Um, that doesn't, that's not a fee that we do. That's like just a, like a worldwide fee to anybody who does it. Um, hundreds of thousands of people all over the world are going to do this. So this is not just for like people who want to go to the games or people who even want to go to regionals. Um, there are age divisions for teenagers and for masters. You're considered a master if you're over 40. And there are age brackets within that. So like 40 to 44 year olds will be bracketed together. Um, you know, 45 to 50, 51 to 54 and so on. Um, all the way up. And so there are, you know people 70 plus around the world that are doing these things. And there are people that have only been doing CrossFit for a week that are doing it. And there are people who've been doing CrossFit for a year that are doing it. Um, and so that was actually me last year. I joined CrossFit Roadhouse last year at the end of January and the Open started at the end of February. So I had been um, doing CrossFit for about a month. Um, I was totally brand new uh, and was scaled in every way and um, People were like, yeah, you should do it. So um, I just kind of jumped in head first and it was so much fun. Um, it's one of the reasons why I still love CrossFit today. I think like it really totally hooked me. Um, each week when we got together to do the workouts, it was really fun to like cheer other people on and um, and then to have them cheer me on. It helped me meet a lot of people at the gym that weren't in my 430 class that I always went to. Um, and then also it was just a blast. It was not highly competitive. Um, it was not something where like I went home if I got beat or felt defeated at all. Um, it was something where at the end I was like, oh my gosh, like I just did that. That was awesome, you know? Um, and so it was fun. I, would, they, I wouldn't say that the workouts were like super easy or anything, but they're definitely doable. They're 100% doable. 
Um, I did scale my workouts last year, so you can go in as an RX division or you can go in scaled. Um, so like if you don't have things like pull-ups or handstand push-ups or muscle-ups or whatever, box jumps, um, then you can always scale it and they'll do things like box step-ups or they'll do hand-release push-ups on the ground instead of handstand push-ups and, um, and things like that. And so um, it's doable for anybody at any skill level. Um, uh, and so anyways, on Thursday nights, what will happen is... Um, Dave Castro will come on and he'll announce what the workout is. And so Thursday nights, we'll all gather around the TV in the gym or you can watch on your phone and he'll announce it to the world. Um, nobody knows what it's going to be. And so it's kind of fun and exciting to see like, what is he going to have us do this week? Um, and then our gym is going to be doing Friday night lights. So on, um, on Fridays, probably at 630 um, we will have the open workout. So anybody who's registered that wants to do it, we'll all be in there together. We'll get signed up. We'll form a little schedule, maybe have two or three people going at the same time. Um, there will be a judge that will watch and score you as you go. By score you, I just mean they're going to help count your reps. They're going to help, you know, make sure that your time is right when you finish and things like that. Help you get the paperwork done and put it into the computer. Um, and, um, and then we'll just go in rounds like that. And, uh, hopefully it'll be a good time of us sitting around and cheering on the people that are going. Um, you know, we can always hang out afterwards or before, um, and things like that. So I think it's going to be really fun. Um, it's not, we're not, you know, competing against each other to see who's better than who or, um, anything like that. And so, um, don't be intimidated by that if you're nervous about competing against somebody. It's going to be just like working out um, with your buddies, which is what we are doing anyways. Um, so we are going to be giving um, challenge points, um, EOC challenge points, for participating in the Open. Um, it is going to be our physical challenge for the month of March. It does start on February 22nd, actually. So um, that's a Thursday, and that'll be the first announcement of the Open. So on Thursday night, February 22nd, um, come on to the gym and be there and ready. Normally they announce at about 7 p.m. Um, so, uh, if you're free that night, come hang out with us and we'll gather around the TV and see what we're going to be doing. Um, and then 20, the February the 23rd will be our first Friday night lights where we will have, um, work out all together and see how it goes. Um, so anyways, um, I'm really excited. I really want everybody to do it. Um, I had a great time doing it last year. I would have regretted it not doing it, I think, after I started watching people and being like, you know, I would have been the girl sitting there being like, dang, I could have done this. Like, um, and I don't mean like physically I could have done it. I just mean like mentally it wasn't as scary um, and as intimidating as maybe I thought that it was going to be at first. It was a fun challenge, doable, and um, it definitely helped me get to know the gym better and um, everybody to get to know me a little better too. So anyways, this is my our desperate plea to say, come on, do the open with us. Um, we love you guys. We're excited that you're here and we want you to have a good time. And um, anyways, and even if you decide that it's just not in the books for you, um, come and join us on Fridays and Thursdays um, and watch and cheer us on. And um, if we have an opening, we might let you jump in there with us. Um, so if you do sign up, it is a commitment to five weeks. So there will be five workouts, five weeks, um, that we will be doing the open. If you have to miss one or whatever, it's not a huge deal. You don't get thrown out or anything like that. So, um, but it'll be during the month of March. If you guys have any questions at all, don't hesitate to call us or ask us at the gym, send us a Facebook message, email, um, and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. So anyways, we hope to see all you guys registering. If you register, let us know. Um, let's write our names on the whiteboard. Those of us that are going to be in the open, I just registered myself right before I made this video. And um, I'm excited to see who's going to do it with us. So you guys have a great night and we'll see you at the gym.